Next, we will recognize the boys' state tournament basketball team. Uh, first, I want to commend their coaching staff, Coach Zach Crawford, Coach Minton, Coach Somers, Coach Harrison, and Chuck. <laughs> For a very long time, I know that these guys and these gentlemen have poured their life. They've changed their lives, they've altered their lives, and they've poured hours on hours into skill development into these players. They've sacrificed family time, they've sacrificed money, they've sacrificed everything for these student athletes, some their own, but most of them somebody else's children. They are back-to-back sub-state qualifiers. They have coached the District Player of the Year. They are conference, district, and sectional champions. They have helped renovate and invested in new locker rooms. They have an all-state performer. They've broken so many records with player records and team records. They fundraise and improve uniforms, practice equipment, training equipment, and overall infrastructure of this program. They went outside their comfort zone and supported the Special Olympics program with raising money and complete, competing or completing the polar plunge back in the fall. And last, I think the most important thing these men have done, especially Coach Crawford, is he has rejuvenated the life into a special volunteer high school super fan, Ronnie Housewright. At this time, I'll turn this over to Coach Head Coach Coach Crawford for the recognition of these boys and teams as individuals. Uh, you speak on Ronnie. I don't like microphones. <laughs> if we talk about Ronnie, it's uh, 6.30. It's probably about time for him to call. So if he calls, I'll put him on the microphone. Uh, our team consisted of Brandon Minton, Dalton Harrison, Andrew Knittle, Blake Head, Jason Christian, Tucker McLean, Nolan Amex, Jackson Plumps, Luke Armstrong, Jordan Weininger Paulus, Cameron Cox, Owen Miller, Brandon Green, and Blake Courtney. Uh, some of them had some track and other things going on tonight. Uh, accomplishments for just this year, we had a 24 and 12 overall record. Uh, District one champs, that was the first time since 2001. Uh, Region one runner up, uh, state tournament Elite Eight in AAA, ranked 10th in the state. Last time we looked, right? Uh, a 3.7 team GPA, two players scoring a 30 plus on the ACT, and Andrew Knittle and Jolt Harrison had a super score of a 30. Uh, food City Thanksgiving tournament, all team, and Andrew Knittle and uh, Joel Harrison, Upper Lakes All Conference Team, Andrew Knittle, Joel Harrison, and Brady Mitten, uh, Upper Lakes All Conference Honorable Mention, and Casey Christian, Blake Head, District All Tournament Team, Andrew Knittle, Joel Harrison, Brady Mitten, Casey Christian, Region All Tournament Team, Andrew Knittle, Joel Harrison, Brady Mitten. 1,000 career points, Brady Minton. 1,500 career points, Andrew Knittle, Joel Harrison. 500 career assists, Brady Minton. Basketball Coaches Association of Tennessee All-Star Game participant, Joel Harrison. FCA <laughs> Tennessee versus Virginia All-Star Game participant, uh, Joel Harrison and Brady Minton. Tennessee Sports Writers Association All-State Team, Jolton Harrison, and uh, can I announce it? <laughs> One's going to go on to the next level and play college ball. He's going to sign next week. 
with Ma Tree. Two weeks, whatever. <laughs> Ma Tree College Blakehead. Two, three. Now this is the good one where you really smile. One, two, three. Yeah.